is the week of October 10, 2017. My name is Bryce. And I am Eric. Welcome to your Ruth Fisher News. Over 400 years ago, Galileo Galilei built a telescope. That was the start of the age of astronomy. The most recent telescope that was launched was the Hubble Telescope back in 1990. It has been doing a wonderful job for NASA for almost 30 years, but its time in space is limited. Now there is a new telescope in the making named the James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST. The telescope is set to launch sometime in 2018. JWST will travel millions of miles from Earth and give a better view of science to science. October is here and you know what that means, Halloween, and people who are looking for pumpkins to put on their patios. Phoenix has places to get the perfect pumpkin for the perfect scare. The best place to get the perfect pumpkin is called Verticillo Farms Corn Maze and Fall Festival which is located in Mesa. Also a fun side note, Phoenix has been a great place for pumpkins over 150 years. In, in fact, Phoenix was almost named Pumpkinville in 1868, but settlers in the area went with the name of Phoenix instead. Now let's go to with Emily with Science Time. Welcome to Science Time. My name is Emily. Today we're going to talk about one of the weirdest animals that you will ever see. This little guy is a Mexican mole lizard. It has T-Rex arms and looks like a worm. It has no back legs and it also looks like a snake. He is pink. So if you see this little lizard, don't be scared, it's just a lizard. Thanks Emily, now let's go over to Elise with Fun Fact Trivia. Welcome to Fun Fact Trivia, my name is Elise. I will give you three facts, you have to guess which one is wrong. A. Drums is the only English word that ends in the letters MT. B. Almonds are a member of the Greek family. C. Maine is the only state that has one syllable name. You have 10 seconds to guess which one is incorrect. Yes, B. You are right. Almonds are actually the member of the Peach family. See you next time on Fun Fact Trivia. Thanks, Elise. Now let's go over to Martin with a joke of the week. Hi, welcome to Joke of the Week. My name is Martin. And I'm Bryce. Martin, what's your joke? What did the buffalo say to his son when he went to college? I don't know. What did he say? Bye, son. <laughs> Great joke, Martin. If you have a joke, then visit the link below. We would love to have you on. See you guys next time on Joke of the Week. Bye. Thanks, Martin. Now let's go over to Kelly with our first teacher interview. Hi, my name is Kelly, and here we have Miss Eimer, a sixth grade science and social studies teacher. My first question, Miss Eimer, is what do you like teaching here? Um, I like teaching here because it's a lot different from where I am from, because I am from Iowa. Uh, and I would say that the kids here are a special kind of weird. My second question is, have you ever taught anywhere else besides Ruth Fisher? Um, I have not. This is my first year teaching. I am fresh out of college. My third question is, is why did you choose to work here? Um, so like I said, I'm from Iowa. And uh, Miss Norman, who works in first grade, is my best friend and we lived together when we were in college in Iowa. So she told me that she really liked it here and I was like, okay, I'll give it a shot. So I moved down here. My last question is, what do you like to do at, after school? Um, after school, I really like to eat. <laughs> um, I like to go and try out the new restaurants because I'm not from here. Uh, I also like to spend time outside and or going to go see live music. Thanks, Ms. Simon, for being our first person on teacher interview. Oh, for sure. I was glad to be here. Thanks, Kelly. Now let's go over to Marco and Haley for a classroom report. Hello, my name is Marco and Haley. And welcome to Classroom Report. We will be talking to you about what's cool and new in the school. We have finished the first week of benchmark testing for the year. I hope everyone did well. I also want to give a quick shout out to our newest club, the Cheer Club, co coached by Coach Halls Root and Coach Norman. This is just one of our new additions to Ruth Fisher After School Clubs offering this year. 
take a look at these pictures from the cheer club. That is all for the classroom report. See you next time. Thanks, Marco and Haley. Just two quick reminders. Wednesday and Thursday are early release for parent-teacher conferences. And Friday, we have no school because of fall break. That's all for this week. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next week. Go, Go Colts! Colts.